What is going on on that football pitch? What is going on people? We are Tottenham TV, just arrived here at the stadium, Brighton at home. Lineups have just come out, exactly the same uh, lineup as last yeah, game. So disappointing, I thought he was going to at least bring out one or, one or two of the new boys um, to give us a chance. It's, I don't know, I, I haven't got any words to say about the last game really, because second half they didn't get 10 men and they didn't get one shot on goal. How can we really, really help? for a win today but we have to, we have to <laughs> and this is our most positive win. fan people ladies and gentlemen yeah, our well, most positive fan i'm being positive by saying we have to hope we have to hope we have to be behind the team and hope that they would, would do some good and they've done it before i mean you ask not every person you ask around this place and you know it's buzzing around here a lot of people but not one person will probably yeah, say to yeah. you that Spurs are going to win today. No, I know. That's the state of what, how things, how bad things are at the moment. That's right. Everywhere and every every guru in the papers have been giving them a loss. But I'm going. I'm going for uh, one nil. I think one nil. Did I say to you before? Yeah, you said one nil. One nil. Um, that, but that's more about uh, belief rather than hope, or hope rather than belief. I mean. <laughs> Yeah, but let's let's get behind them. Let's hope that they really have fight for it. They can do it. They've done it before. Let's hope they can do it. Absolutely. Let's show some fight on that pitch today. Uh, the fans will be with you if they are uh, going to give it to us on the pitch. So please, just give us a performance today. I'm going for two two. That's kind of the most positive I, I could go. That's the max of my positive my positivity allows me today. But we'll see you inside. Come yeah, on, come on, Spurs. Just found Brian here at the Enoch protest. What's the uh, What's your score? Fight. We're going to have to fight. <laughs> What's your score prediction today? Same lineup. Oh, same Unchanged. lineup. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm doing it. Three one Brighton. Three one Brighton. Three one Brighton. And I was saying before, like you would be hard pressed to find a Spurs fan on this high road that thinks we're going to win today. Yeah, I mean, I, I heard the bookies are making us uh, all them favourites. Yeah. Um, yeah. Look, I, I don't want to be the depressing uh, negative one, but you, you look at it, they are playing some astonishing football. They really are. They are a team that are playing such fluid football all together. Even that Ferguson, that Ferguson, that youngster looks incredible. Just a style of play. And it's gonna, we, we sit back, sit back, sit back, and if we allow them to play, I, and do you know what it is? Well, the same team. I mean, I would have made a couple of changes. What would you? you have done? I mean, well, first of all, you know where I'm going to go straight away. Lloris, Fraser Foster yeah. in goal for straight away. Let, let's get. Let's all get ready now for a heart attack every time the ball gets passed back. <laughs> uh, we we'll all have a heart attack and go. Oh my God! Um, oh, you're making me feel so much better mate, about mate, to walk into you know the what? stadium. I, I, honestly, they put my saw on the goddamn co program cover. I'd have put him in for either Skip or Hoiberg, in all honesty, over the last few games. Get Mundo uh, or Divine in, why not? Uh, oh, mate, you know me and my boy Divine. <laughs> but also the other one, <laughs> have you seen Dan Juma? Because <laughs> uh, no one else bloody Where was. Where is he? I'm uh, looking exactly, for him around wait, here. Wait. Can you see him? Anyone seen Dan Juma? <laughs> have you seen Dan Juma? <laughs> no. Nope. <laughs> no, no one's seen Dan Juma. The police ain't seen Dan Juma. There's a miss <laughs> missing people, person's report. <laughs> uh, that's where I would have seen it. We'll see you inside, people. See you later, Come people. <laughs>
the uh, speakers just for the game. It's hard not to feel a little bit more positive. Come on, let's do this today. Kickoff delayed here, there's no referee on the pitch for about two minutes past the kickoff time. The referee is nowhere to be seen apparently. Uh, probably for the best of things to be honest, but let's see what happens. What was that ground by? Someone gave him a red card. He's <laughs> probably deserves one already. <laughs> Finally, we have a referee and the game can commence. Come on, you Spurs. Pull it out of the bag for once. And here comes Spurs with Jürgen Milsson. Outside to Perisic. Get it in the box, Perry, and get it away. First meaningful attack of the game, and nothing really comes of it. Not much going on so far. about to get our decision. Yeah, I mean Brighton were in sense that it was a handball. Come on. Let the VAR gods be on our side for this time. It's taken ages. It's taken ages. It's been a minute already. Not given. Free kick to Spurs. Decision, no goal. It's a handball from Mitoma, that's what they were checking. And um, that's why the goal is disallowed, not offside, but it's a handball from Mitoma. Come on, you Spurs. Here comes Jun Son, he's got the runners either side of him. He shifts out, Skippy. Come on. Come on, Sonny. Offside, terrible. That is awful. That is awful. How could he be caught offside from there? Okay, touch from Clement Longley to win the ball. Now Spurs are high up the pitch with Harry Kane. Harry Kane shifts in and loses the ball. Wins it back. Come on, you Spurs. Here's Ollie Skip. 
Oh, he turns away and loses the ball. That's awful from Skippy. Oh, the calamity of errors at the moment, Tottenham. Hoybier completely losing it on the edge of the box. They hit the post and here they're coming forward again. McAllister. And just about block. And Hoybier again. Oh my God. What is going on on that football pitch? I mean, Grandma, we might be 1 0 up here, but it's absolutely, we're not playing well at all. 70% possession with Brighton. No control. It's, all it is has been a, an absolute lucky goal, an unbelievable goal that's got us through this. Look who showed up. <laughs> just, come, really just come from the protest. Yes, hot off the press, hot <laughs> off the press. Have you, have you found Dad Juby yet? <laughs> um, still looking for him. No, still Juba. can't find him. Wally. Where's Dan Juba? Hoybier! Oh, Sonny fed him through. Really good position there from Hoybier. Good block and it's cornered to Spurs. Another good opening for Spurs, but still, they're not playing well at all. We've had a few good openings, but it's been all bright, let's be honest. Now it is 1 1 in the 33rd minute. Sun rises above everyone in the box from the corner, and it's 1 1. Sonny Marge. Puts his fingers up against his lips and shushes the Spurs crowd. Oh, no, There's just no one there. Absolutely no one there to block him. It's an absolute simple corner into Dunn. Nobody defending whatsoever. It's a shambles. Absolute shambles at the back. What's that, Ryan? What'd you say? It's just a disgrace, man. Just how can you defend like that from a corner? Well, but here comes over the top to Harry Kane, Hillman Son. Shoot! Plays it to Kulu, back to Son, and it looks like the move is breaking down. Perris it. Crosses it. High, wide, and not at all hands, and that is terrible for Perris. Absolutely terrible. But back to my point, like, how can you defend like that from a corner? Brian, please tell me, how can you defend like that from a corner? How? Uh, how? Absolutely nobody there. Free header, rises above everyone. I, I, I do me a favour, man. Yeah. 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 Mark, it is natural. You've left one of their centre backs clear as day ready to do that. It's also the problem. More shambolic defending as Eric Dyer slips. And not only does he slip to let Brian in, but he's pointing the fingers at everyone else. He's pointing the fingers at everyone else and really trying to push blame of anyone else. How is anyone else's fault? I don't know, but it's a corner to Brighton. From Kulisevsky. Oh, trickery in the box. Is that a penalty? Oh, he's given a dive. He's given a dive, a free kick the other way, but really good trickery from Kulisevsky uh, to beat two men there. It's Kulisevsky. Oh, just as he looked to shape up and take the shot, the ball just went away from him. I don't know what happened there. But there is something, it's a bit slippery on the pitch. Everyone keeps slipping and sliding everywhere. But I mean, this has been probably the longest passing passage of play Spurs have had. We keep losing the ball and just giving the ball away in stupid areas. Brian, what are you thinking of the first half? Uh, listen, we, we started off brightly. We actually did look like we were coming out attacking. Scored a goal, and my God, what a cracker. What an absolute cracker. And then, uh, as, uh, to coin uh, a tune from my very good brother Ben, um, the circus of the defence came into town. Um, I think you can see from uh, Hugo Lloris, the fans were urging him not to play as short, he's kicking it now. Defence, we're just a shambles, aren't we? We are an absolute shambles. Uh, going forward, there's, there's glimpses, but we get, we get to the final third, and it's like... Duh, 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 duh. Right, Brighton had 72% possession in that first half. <laughs> Mate, they listen, they're, they're cutting through us, they're going through us like a knife like butter on them. They really are, they're playing football. And every time they don't go through us, we just give it back to them. Yeah, it's like, here you go, try again, try again, better luck next time. Listen, I'd like to say, we need to start coming out to the theme tune. Things can only get better, but they don't. But let's hope they do. Let's hope they bloody well do. How are you, Spurs? Oh, ball came over the top from Becky. Give you a Dejan Kulisevsky, Ivan Perisic. Shot, still as equal to it as corner to Spurs. First opening of the second half, well, 51 minutes in. But you know what? It's been absolutely terrible in the second half so far. 
all Brighton, as it was pretty much in the first half anyway. And here come the corner. Ivan Perisic to put it in. Comes in, good ball. Harry Kane, the back post, but Esther Pinion gets it away. No, nothing's going to come out of this. Oh, I thought the ref was just about to point to the spot there for a penalty. It did strike the arm of the Brighton defender, but Spurs are offside and it's a free kick the other way. <laughs> Brighton go 2 1 up, 54 minutes in. Shocking defending, even more shocking goalkeeping from Tottenham Hotspur. It looked like it was a routine save just to go straight, push it out, lets it go all the way through him. It's an awful, awful mistake from Hugo Lloris. Spurs are 2-1 down. I'm waiting to see. I want to see that again, but just the calamity all around that goal. This football club, man. This football club. They're going back to VAR. Possible handball, they're saying. Come on. We definitely deserve to be losing here, but we might get lucky once again. We got away with it once again. Second goal for Brighton ruled out for handball. Oh, just seeing it now. Yeah, it is a handball from the canister. I mean, his arms are right by his side. I don't, I don't really get that to be honest. But Hugo, man, got away with one massively, massively. Come on, surely time's going to be up soon. Brian with a cheeky vape behind me. Four minutes left. Brian with a cheeky vape. <laughs> You're my shield. Four minutes left, I'd say. Four minutes, Ryan reckons. Everyone behind the ball for Tottenham now. Romero to get it away. Well done, Kuti. Now, now Only as far as Caicedo. We're the 10 behind the ball, aren't we? Now we're okay with 10 behind the ball. <laughs> now we're okay with it. Just not when there's 15 minutes to go. It's all about defending as a team and seeing it out. Just not when there's 9 minutes right. to go. <laughs> Last minute break for the top of the his arm out, Dan Juma gets tackled. It's got, surely got to be time now. Chasing back. Spurs minutes away, even not seconds away from three points here against a very good Brighton team. Last attack for Brighton, it comes in! Oh my god! Oh my god, I thought that struck the arm! Great anticipation for Romero and Spurs are going to Harry Kane! Come <laughs> on! 
one and two, Brighton one. Like, subscribe and comment, and as always, come on you Spurs.